Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. How much tax do I have to pay for crypto? And cryptocurrency taxation can be complex. The IRS treats cryptocurrency as property for tax purposes. This means that general tax principles applicable to property transactions apply to crypto. When you sell or exchange cryptocurrency, you may have to pay capital gains tax. The amount of tax you owe depends on how long you held the crypto before selling it. If you held the cryptocurrency for more than a year, it is considered a long-term capital gain. Long-term capital gains typically have lower tax rates than short-term gains. Then, if you held the cryptocurrency for a year or less, it is considered a short-term capital gain. Short-term capital gains are taxed at your ordinary income tax rate. You must report any gains or losses from cryptocurrency transactions on your tax return. If you receive cryptocurrency as payment for goods or services, it is taxed as ordinary income. The fair market value of the cryptocurrency on the date you receive it is included in your gross income. Mining cryptocurrency also generates taxable income. The fair market value of the mined cryptocurrency on the date of receipt is included in your gross income. You may also have to pay self-employment tax if you mine cryptocurrency as a trade or business. Keep detailed records of all your cryptocurrency transactions. Then inaccurate record keeping helps ensure you report the correct amount of tax. Failure to report cryptocurrency transactions can result in penalties and interest. Consult a tax professional for personalized advice on your specific situation. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning into our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.